Hello guys, my name is Malik and I'm from Sydney Language Solutions. I hope you guys are doing well. And today we're gonna talk about uh, some important stuff related to a listening section, which is the last section of a PTE exam. Uh, it is the most uh, lengthiest section in a PTE exam, which has got eight questions in it. And uh, we're gonna talk about that what questions, which questions are important and which questions are less important. So we can focus more on the important questions. You get a good mark or you could say a desired mark. Could be 65 plus, it could be 79 plus. It's gonna be the same for both of you guys. Okay, so listening. Guys, I'm gonna be writing uh, abbreviations of the questions. Otherwise, you know, if I keep on writing the entire question, I won't, I won't have enough space. So the first question we're gonna be getting is MCQs, single, MCQs, multiple. And next question is highlight, correct summary, select missing words, fill in the blanks, Highlight incorrect words and WFD, which is the right from dictation. Okay, guys, as I mentioned, that I'm gonna let you know that some questions are important and some questions are not important in the listening section. If you guys do not know that which questions are not important and you guys spending too much time on that, then you guys do not have enough time for the last question, which is right from dictation. And it is a kind of a trick as well from the Pearson that they know that if if the students you know spend so much time in the middle or at the start then the students won't be able to reach the last question and which is not good if you guys are unable to do the right from dictation well put it this way if you really want a 79 plus and if you are unable to reach the right from dictation or if you messing up that question then trust me you guys have to go home and book the test again because it's not gonna happen as 79 plus um, test takers you guys know that you guys do not really have a big margin for for the error and if you are messing up the whole question which gives you pretty much most of the marks for listening and writing then of course you know then you guys have to go home and book the test again so please be mindful about it that you guys really have to focus on this question and do this question properly and in time so I'm gonna tell you how to manage your time a little bit in this section okay as I missed the first question that is my mistake the first question is SWT Sorry, it's SST. SST stands for Summarize Spoken Text. Okay, this question is important as well. So this question will always come as your first question. So SST will always come as your first question. The rest of four to five questions, like MCQ single, MCQs multiple, highlight, correct summary, select missing word, and fill in the blanks. As you can see that I have circled these questions one two three four five these five questions in the middle after summarized spoken text they can come in any sequence okay I repeat again summarize spoken text which is always your first question followed by these five questions it could be any sequence okay and your second last question will always be highlight incorrect words and the last question is right from dictation so the middle part is not that important excluding filling in blanks okay so let's talk about the important and, and and the least important questions so the important one is summarize spoken text which is the first question then it's fill in the blanks then it's highlight incorrect words and write from dictation the middle part is select missing words highlight correct summary mcq single answer mcq's multiple multiple answers these four questions not that important how so you guys should learn how to manage the time in the listening section oh sorry i forgot to mention about the timings in the listening section for example for the quest, first question you get a separate time for that one if you get two summaries you will have 10 minutes each for that question type but for the rest of the questions from mcq single till right from dictation you guys will be given a time collectively so you guys have to manage the time properly if you guys do not know how to manage the time properly then there you go you won't be able to do right from dictation and as i mentioned in this video that there are some unimportant questions which you guys really do not have to worry about much i'm not saying that you guys are allowed to skip and another thing in the listening section you are unable to skip the question 
and of course they are coming in the exam and I'm, I'm not saying that you do not really have to worry about that one worry about a little bit those ones but do not focus more towards those questions because those questions have very few marks as compared to the rest of the questions which are important questions for example right from dictation gives you massive marks so practice that one and learn how to manage the time in a listening section i hope it tells you a little bit about the sections about the timings and the importance and uh, we discuss more about it in details in the class thank you so much guys for watching the video you guys have a good day